Coming up next week, terrorism, biofuels and mini plenary. Welcome to the agenda. How to counter radicalization, where do you start and is terrorism legislation strong enough? On Tuesday, the Parliament will hold court on the creeping threat of terrorism. Invited speakers include an Islamic consultant from the Belgian Prison Service, a Belgian federal prosecutor and the chair of the European Police Confederation. Later on in the week, also look out for Europol TV's interview with another invitee, Robert Wainwright, the director of Europol. Post Paris attacks, security was beefed up outside important landmarks and buildings like the Parliament. How much money should be spent on security? Well, here's a figure, 190 billion euros. That's how much member states spend outside of the EU budget. Could the money allocated for EU military and civilian operations be better spent? The Foreign Affairs and Security and Defence Committee put funding to a vote on Tuesday. Switching gears and coming across a little bit wacky, it's over to the Environment Committee who'll be making a case for seaweed and waste. They've not lost the plot. These are just two examples of the so-called new generation biofuels that MEPs will make a push for to wean off dependency on traditional fossil fuels. All the I's were dotted, all the T's crossed. But a year and a half after a successful citizens' initiative to trigger legislation to make water a basic human right, well, not a lot has really happened. Q protests outside the Parliament in March. For its part, the Parliament did follow through with a draft report. So what are the next steps? Members of the Environment Committee will take another look at the report on Tuesday. And finally, making its return to the Brussels Chamber, the mini plenary. And this time, it's got a social agenda. MEPs will discuss the multi-annual financial framework for the years ahead, factory fires in Bangladesh, and mark 100 years since the Armenian Genocide. And that's all we have for this agenda. Take care. And enjoy the week.